Hello first grade. Today we're going to work on counting on and regrouping. So Sue has nine tennis balls and three soccer balls. How many balls does she have? Now if you remember, we can break that three apart and give one of the numbers to the nine to make ten. So let's break it apart. Broke it apart into one and two. Nine and one is ten. How many are left over? Two. Yes. So, 9 plus 3 equals the same as 10 plus 2. They both equal 12. Nice job. 9 and 4. I want to break the 4 apart so that I can make a 10. So let's break it apart. 1 and 3. So what number is left over? If that 1 is going to go with the 9, I have the 3 left over. Very good. So that means 9 plus 4 equals 13 and 10 plus 3 equals 13. Now let's take a look at this. 9 plus 2. I can break the 2 apart to 1 and 1. So 10 plus 1 is 11. So that means 9 plus 2 is 11. 9 plus 5. Let's break that apart. I can break it into 1 and 4. I'm going to give the 1 to the 9 to make 10, which means I have 4 left over. 10 plus 4. So 10 plus 4 is 14, just like 9 plus 5 is 14. Let's take a look at this last problem. 9 plus 4. Well, let's break that 4 apart so we can give some to the 9. There we go. The 9 is going to take that 1 and make 10. How many were left over? That's right, 3, 10 plus 3. 10 plus 3 is 13. 9 plus 4 is 13. So you see what you like better. Do you like to count on and go 9, 10, 11, 12, 13? Or do you like to break it apart and go 10 plus 3, 13? Which way is easier for you? Have a good day.